I think um, I think as I as I picked up fly fishing, um, it definitely kind of clicked uh, in me that not only do I like being outside, but I need to be outside. I don't think I really realized that until I got into my later college years, but um, I, I definitely need to be able to spend some time outside. It's it's necessary. Yeah. When did you when did you start fly fishing? And did you fish before? fly fishing so so i fished my entire life actually okay. so uh in, in addition to talking but uh before this i i was reading these questions uh you know and uh i can't even remember the first fish i caught i've been fishing that long um i i definitely remember going after smallmouth bass in the springtime with my brother when we were like in grade school um we'd go out there with little cleos and spin gear um that's how i grew up fishing um always big on pitching lures um i used to always fish a lot of night crawler rigs i i grew up fishing out on the the lake with my family for lake erie yellow perch so i was very lucky in that respect um and then beyond perch fishing it was my my grandfather that was obsessed with steelhead and i'd go with him all the time didn't matter how cold it was as long as we could get the boat in we would put in and we would go out front of the creek mouths actually and flatline troll that's how we used to catch them uh and then my my senior year of college i lived in that the outdoors clubhouse and uh luckily enough one of my roommate's boyfriends, he grew up fly fishing. He was from Maine and he thought it was crazy that I'd never gone in the creeks for steelhead, but he'd only ever fly fished. So when we came back to my hometown to go for steelhead in the creeks, I had borrowed fly gear. Uh, so I've, I've been fly fishing since, um, but I, I guess I got introduced to it with a fly rod in my hand uh, the fall of 2015. All right. So how did that lead into becoming a guide? Because that seems like, whoa, this just exploded. And you were like, yeah, I'm all in. That's, that's basically how it went. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, I don't know. I think... Uh, I think that there was a, there's a lot of similarities between fly fishing and golf. And I think growing up golfing, um, I was okay with doing something that's kind of inherently frustrating when you first get going. I, <laughs> uh, but I guess um, the big thing that kept drawing me to, to the fly fishing was uh, just that every time you go out, you're learning something. And and I, I think it's like that with every kind of fishing, okay, I really do. But there's something about fly fishing that um, there's so much to it that, um, I mean, heck, uh, the, the wonderful folks that I got to fish with on Monday, I was talking to them about swinging big streamers for steelhead. And um, they're all phenomenal Euro nymphers. So it's just, um, it's amazing that there's so many different aspects to it. I think that that's, yeah. that's part of my allure to it because I, I've uh, never Euro nymph, but I learned so much about it on Monday that I'm surely going to be rigging up the Euro rod I got for Christmas and using that when I go trout fishing this weekend. Yeah, yeah. I, I just, uh, I like that there's so much to it. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, a never ending learning process for sure. Sure.